Uh, so it's going to take a second for us to bounce back. Clearly. Uh, it's going to take a second. I'm thinking tomorrow All right. that starts the trend. So you got to hang in there. That's why I've been can telling do everybody. This. Yeah, you got to <laughs> hang in there. Uh, the clouds are holding tough. That's going to make it tough to warm up once again. Uh, sunrise and sunset times are going to have us uh, pretty much in the 6 p.m. hour or 6 a.m. hour, I should say, around 628 this morning and 834. That'll be your sunset time. But we have a lot of clouds to get through. 40 degrees in downtown Detroit. Feels like 33 winds from the west at 12 miles per hour and even the relative humidity is at 73%. We're still tracking these rain and snow showers rolling through Metro Detroit right now from Oak Park to Livonia 38 and 37 degrees up near Holly you're at 36 and at least with the radar scans it looks like you're getting some rain and snow mixing in. Uh, this is going to be fair game for the rest of today because an area of low pressure, even though it's moved a touch, it hasn't moved enough uh, to stop influencing our weather. So notice the spin around it. It's going to continue to keep us in play to see the rain and also the snow showers. So your bus stop forecast today. Temperatures are going to be in the 30s. When you factor in the winds, it's going to feel a touch colder even than that. Uh, snow will be possible, so pack the rain gear. You'll need it for not only the morning, but also for the afternoon. 44 will be the high temp, cool and cloudy with those lingering showers. Highs across all of Metro Detroit, the entire area in the mid to low 40s, far below average. Our high should be around 65 to 66, far removed from that. Same thing for tonight. 36 will be the overnight low. Winds be from the northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. So we'll finally break this pattern, but it's not going to happen until after Wednesday morning. We'll still have some leftovers with the clouds and numbers in the 40s, but slowly as that area of low pressure pulls away, Watch how the temperatures respond going into Thursday. That's when we get those highs back in the upper 50s to near 60 degrees. And once that happens, I'm happy to say it's going to stick around for a little bit throughout the weekend going into next week as well as temperatures climb near 70.